So for number seven, it is asking us um, to mark in the xy plane all nine linear combinations of the vector 2, 1, and 0, 1, um, which is the combination C of the first vector plus D times the second vector, and we're given these parameters here. So we're going to uh, do all nine combinations, right? Where let's do the uh, put a vector here for the linear combinations. So the linear combination is going to be uh, C times 2 for the first one. So it's going to be uh, 2C plus 0D. And the second element is going to be C times 1. So that's going to be C plus uh, D times 1. C plus D. Okay, so that is going to be our vector. So let's begin with uh, C is equal to 0 and D is equal to 0. Um, in this case, we are going to have uh, 2 times 0 is equal to 0, and then uh, 0 plus 0 is going to give us 0. And then we're going to do where C is equal to 1 and D is equal to 0. And then here we're going to have 2 times 1, so that's going to be 2. And then we're going to have um, 1 plus 0, so that's going to be 1. And then we're going to have that C is equal to 2 and D is equal to 0. So in this case, we're going to have uh, 2 times 2, that's going to be 4. And the second one's going to be um, 2 times C, so 2 plus 0, that's going to be 2. Okay, then we're going to do where C is equal to 0 and then D is equal to 1. So in this case, we're going to have uh, 2 times 0, which is 0 on top, and then 0 plus 1, so here. And then we're going to have where C is equal to 1 and D is equal to 1. Uh, then we're going to have 2 times 1 is 2, and the second element is going to be 1 plus 1, so we're going to have 2. And then where C is equal to 2 and D is equal to 1. So we're going to have, let's see, 2 times 2 is going to be 4, um, and the second element is going to be 1, 2 plus 1, so that is going to be 3. Yeah. Let me see if that is correct. Yeah, 2 plus 1. And then, let's see, let me, we're going to do where C is equal to 0 and then D is equal to 2. So in this case, we're going to have 0 and then 0 plus 2 is 0, 2. And then where C is equal to 1 and D is equal to 2. So in this case, we're going to have um, 2 times 1, so 2. And then that is going to be um, 2 plus 1. So that will be 3. And then we're going to have where C is equal to 2 and D is equal to 2. And in this case, we're going to have um, on top, we're going to have 2 times 2 is 4. And then 2 plus 2, we are going to have 4. OK. So once we have these, uh, let's mark these in. We're going to begin by this one here, where C is 0 and D is 0. So that's just going to be the 0, 0 vector. And then we're going to go here, which is going to be uh, 2, 2 in the x and 1 in the y. So 2 in the x and 1 in the y. Uh, I guess my scale should have included 4, so I'm going to put that in here, 4. Okay. And then we're going to go where uh, 4 in the x and then 2 in the y. So we're going to go here. Then we're going to have 0 in the x and 1 in the y then um, 2 in the x and 2 in the y, and then we're going to have, let's see, 4 in the x and 3 in the y. Okay, then we are going to have 0x, 2y, and then um, 2x, 3y, and then lastly 4x and 4y. Yeah, so these are the points that we get when we uh, plot all of them in the XY plane.